click on the subscribe button to watch more videos on my youtube channel and also click on this bell icon to get all notifications on your mail hi friends in this video i am going to explain how to develop a 3d cone in autocad already explained how to draw the uh, 2d model cone and how to fabricate the cone explanation in my previous tutorials you can also watch my previous tutorials in the description i will provide this uh, these two links and you can observe the uh, 2d cone of these top dimensions and 216 od and 200 id and the 516 od uh, outer diameter and the internal diameters and thickness is 8 mm and the 450 height this is the cone i want to develop in 3d in AutoCAD of the 3D modeling already explained about the 2D modeling of the cone and open the AutoCAD software after opening the AutoCAD software uh, the interface is like this you can observe and go on to the new option and click on that and you can observe the templates and select the ACAD and select the open with no template metric because not all dimensions are in mm I am considering mm is nothing but a millimeters open with no template metric and select the open with no template metric after that this is the interface this is the 3d modeling I already selected we want to uh, go on to the 3d modeling go to the workspace settings you can observe the workspace and select the 3d modeling then the workbench will change us to 2d model to 3d model then you can observe the 3d operations and the tools you can abuse before you want to develop the model and the O snap settings and select all the O snap settings of the intersection edge points and the midpoints and select all and click on OK and go on to the visualize before you want to develop the 3D model go on to the visualize first select the way what you want the style easy to construct the object I am selecting the conceptual and select the SW isometric uh, southwest isometric this is the, the XYZ directions changes like this then you want to develop the any model it look like a 3D model object i will show the example also and go on to the home option here i want to explain about the uh, how to develop the cone already explained the basic tutorials of the cone for the beginners this is the one of the model i want to develop the general cone drawing the 516 od and the 500 od is the top uh, cone and the small radius of saw is 200 id and the some of the 216 od and first go on to the cone option and cone command and you can select the specify center point at the base point on the space and drag like this you can observe this and specify the base radius I'm giving the diameter because the 516 node is the diameter I mentioned on the drawing and you can observe the cone specify height it is asking after that and click on the cone specify top radius because we are developing the two radius on the top and the bottom because uh, I'm selecting the top radius and cone specify the top radius the top radius is uh, 200 I think but the 216 OD uh, you want to the radius 216 by 2 then you get the radius I am simply typing the 216 by 2 then simply you get the half of the dimensions you can observe I will show the all of the dimensions and select the cone height 450 uh, see the 450 height is the one of the cone is created and you can observe the uh, 3d solid model base radius is 258 and the top radius is 108 and the height is 450 I simply divided by 2 then I get the one 108 radius by double click on that you can observe the dimensions and the cone space for center point again I want to develop the again internal diameters before I develop the outer diameters here I want to develop the outer di internal diameter um, dimensions you can observe this I am selecting the shape of gray because it is easily to visualize and you can observe the uh, 500 ID as the 200 ID simply give the radius of 500 and the diameter is 500 I am giving we want to give the radius of uh, 200 simply 200 by 2 give the 100 radius uh, to the cone and you can observe the uh, 450 is the height same as both are height same then the two solid models are created on the on object you want to subtract this to form a halo type object simply subtract command su the shortcut is su subtract you can observe on the command line prompt and click on the subtract command 
and you can observe the first object select the first object enter and select the second object enter click on enter option then the remove the material is uh, possible and you can observe on the screen the inside the remove material is removed then the cone is created the actual cone what you want in the 3d model this is the cone is created by using dot so already explained about the cone in katia also you can also check on my previous tutorials and this is the cone is constructed you want to rotate this simply 3d orbit option and again the option is 3d f orbit 3d f orbit you can revolve the any of the directions of the top and the front and the bottom of the 360 degree and the 3d orbit is somewhat different from 3d f orbit you can observe them i'm rotating the cone like this you want to give the different types of views or the front view top view side view this is also view configuration model viewports configuration also available on the visual edge palette you can observe the different types of tools and the viewport configuration and select the viewport configuration and the three horizontal and the three below like this here some of the you can observe i'm select the four equal you can observe to highlight the front view and the top view and the side view and the isometric view by this views you can um observe the all of the views you can also observe the views by using the sw isometrics you can observe the um views uh, tools you can observe the top bottom left and the side view and the isometric view different types of southeast and the southwest and the northwest or some of the views are available you can observe this is the general cone drawing in autocad of the three dimensional model this is the basic tutorial for the beginners Thank you.